I say family. Um, <laughs> let me, let's dive right into it. Y'all know this. This your dog, man. Um, man, real talk. Um, I just want to say thank you to all the positive messages. Um, I've been receiving inboxes. I've been receiving um, a lot of comments on the the video. <laughs> um, but it lets me know that the way that I'm doing things and why I'm doing things is is correct for me. Because I know you're not. I know I'm not going to reach everybody. I know I'm not going to touch everybody. I know a lot of people aren't going to feel the same way that I feel. I know there's a lot of people that's going to gravitate to negative people versus positive people. I get it, fam. That's why, uh, you know, I got a lot of comments that I was in my feelings, but I see I didn't attack the brother. <laughs> I'm in my feelings. You know, I'm, I actually laugh. I, it's still funny to me right now that that he went the way he went. Um, and if you guys don't know, go look at the, the video that I put about Charlton White changing my ass. So I'm thinking, thanking the people that actually, you know, to this day, I'm still getting positive inboxes, messages, comments. Um, once again, I didn't think it would take off like this, um, which, like I said, this is to to say thank you to the brothers that's and sisters that are saying keep doing what I'm doing, positivity, just being positive. <clears throat> but I want to also, with those young brothers, this is a message to you guys. And like I said, I, I don't think I'll see it in my generation family. I I I really have some homework for you guys. Um, solidarity doesn't mean that you have to follow one person. Solidarity doesn't mean you guys get on here and, hey, man, we all going to go with go with Edwin or we all going to go with this person or we all going to go with this this person. No, solidarity means that we all support each other. We support each other. We come together. You know, I hear people talk about stuff. And it just doesn't make sense to me. You know, if we, it, how can we have a black vote without black unity? How? How can we have a black vote without a black bank? How can we have black businesses and black townships and black communities without a black financial entity? So I want you guys to do some homework on the LGBTQ community. Now, I want you to be open-minded. I want you to look at the structure. Like I said, I think that is the, you know, how everybody say, what's the plan? What's the blueprint? There you go. When you look at all of the different departments, all of the different Everybody has their own whatever. I, I, you know, you got people that's talking trans, 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 trans. You got people that's talking gay, 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 gay. You're talking people that's talking lesbian, 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 lesbian. But the trans, you will get a little drama. Don't get it twisted. You'll get a little drama. You're going to get the, the gays fussing with the trans and, the, and you, know, you get a little drama. You get a little drama. But look at the overall umbrella of the LGBTQ community. Okay? Like I said, you don't have to follow one thing. If if you if you wanna listen to me, I'ma always speak the truth. Okay? So we're under the umbrella of black unity, right? We're gonna have what you guys call ho tempers. We're speaking the truth. You're gonna have these guys over here called we are Indians. We, they, they speak whatever the fuck they want to speak. You're going to have people talking about um, <clears throat> they still want to be Christians. You're going to have black people over here talking about that, you know, um, <laughs> we're, we're, we're Italians. Whatever the case may be, long as you put the community first, long as you put the, the, the movement first, there, I mean, that's the structure. And we don't, and then we have to stop. We have to stop banging against each and everybody. Like I said, there's going to be a little bit. There's a lot of things that we have to do, undo. 
there's a lot of things that we have to undo. Everybody, listen, man, everybody can agree that you got at least six different people reading the Bible and saying that this book means this and this book means that and this book means this and this part means that. And everybody can find scripture that supports them. If you want to be stuck in that, you know, be. I don't understand how people don't have the understanding that if I teach the truth, but then I also teach the lie, but then I also am a pedophile, then I also am uh, loving, but then I also say, you know, you got to go against the family. I don't understand how we get involved in, see that's what I'm saying? I don't understand how we get involved in that shit. So I can speak on it and say, I could go, I could, and that's why I told y'all I, I never like debating. You know why I don't like debating? Because if I find out the truth or, or if I find out you lied to me, lied to me, then everything that you say now in the back of my mind is a lie. And we can do that. We do that with each other because you can look at people's page like, <laughs> I knew dude was a fraud a long time ago. Uh, I'm just going to say HC that everybody's attacking right now. I'm going to I'm gonna say that I knew he was a fraud a long time ago because one thing that I told y'all that I did, I reached out to all the influential people that I saw on, 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 on social media and I asked them one question. How can we come together as black people without a tragedy? That was my mission. That was my sole goal is to say, how can we do this? I do believe black solidarity is the way we do this, but you have to understand that nobody gave me an answer. And I and I've showed you guys this because I looked at those I looked at preachers as mentors at one point in time. I sent it to Creflo Dollar. I sent it to TJ T D what is it? T D Jakes. I sent it to all these black people that I thought would want solidarity between everybody. But they don't. They want to keep banging against each other. They want to keep fighting against each other. And that's the wrong way to do it. Solidarity is the key. Create that umbrella, whatever you want to call it. And everybody in this, uh, under this umbrella, we all support it. We all give $5 to this person. We all give $5 to that person. Give what you can. That's how they operate. Look, look them up, family. I want you guys to study them. And like I said, I want to thank you for all the positivity. So now from, I'm moving forward. I'm not banging on anybody that's so, too much directly. You'll still get it because I still think there's a lot of frauds out there. You guys know there's a lot of frauds out there. You know, uh, YP, how can you say black woman is God and then get on there and make a video? If you bitches want to be here, you bitches are going to be control not fucking you, you're going to fucking follow what i say how <laughs> that doesn't make that doesn't make sense but we don't need to make a i don't need to make a 15 hour lecture or hour lecture about that concept do i do uh, that's not even this is what i'm saying when i say there's levels to this shit i really mean that family you're exposing yourself you cannot say the black woman is god you you believe that the woman is the creator and all of this other stuff, then get on there and call people that you've been intimate with bitches. You don't believe it. You don't believe it. You can't believe it. You can't believe it. Have y'all and I know what y'all gonna do. I know y'all gonna go back through my timeline and be like, oh, he has a baby mama. Let's see what he says about his baby mama to find it. Once, I, once, I, once again, I told y'all, you're looking at the truth. It, it, it's, it's, there's nothing to be, it's not, I'm not, I don't want to be braggadocious about it, but you're looking at the truth because I already know if I said those things or if somebody knew that I did this or knew that I did that, they would attack me. One of my first tattoos, man. One of my first tattoos, the truth. You're looking at the truth. I always felt that way. I felt that way since I was a kid. I always felt like motherfuckers is fake. No matter what, no matter. 
I've seen motherfuckers do dirty shit and then turn around and deny that they did the shit. Now, I'm not going to turn around and deny the shit. I'm just not going to speak on it. That's a difference. I don't need to let everybody know what the fuck I did. And that's the problem with everybody right now is that they talk. You put this in front of somebody, they're going to talk about all the shit that they did. And once again, I ain't done no bad shit like that. I used to do ignorant shit. It's a difference. But once again, like I said, you ain't got to... Let's get back on track. You don't have to... Solidarity doesn't mean that you have to follow just one person. Like I said, the umbrella of the LGBTQ... And I fucking... I did a video about it saying that this is the way you got... This is the way we should be. This is the way we should be. Now, if you want to put that umbrella with just conscious people in it or just people that's moving towards black people, you want to leave out religion, which I think that's the way it should be because you've never seen solidarity between religious folks. Have you? They they bang on each other harder than anything else because their book says that if anybody else is teaching something different, you should kill them. So Muslims really hate Christians and Christians hate Muslims. That's a different religion, right? Prophet Muhammad, Jesus. It's different. That's a different teaching. But it's the same thing. Kill these motherfuckers. So, I do believe you should leave religion out of it. But like I said, somebody might have an idea that they're conscious, right? And you want to elevate in these levels. Because see, the basis of a conscious group would also be levels. Like you might start off believing that you're Indians. And then you might find out nobody that you call an Indian ever called themselves an Indian and you move up <laughs> and say, hey, these, these people were Aboriginal of this land. These people weren't Indians. What are you talking about? They weren't Indians. They was the Aboriginal people of this land. And now you may stay with these people here or Aboriginal of this land. They didn't come from Africa. They didn't come from anywhere else. And then you start looking at the artifacts that these people had and they're African artifacts. Then you move up to the truth. See, you can start here and keep moving up. Now, like I said, I think the truth should set everybody free. But we have to stop banging on each other because somebody is here and you think you're here. I'm tired of it. I'm tired of it. That's why I don't do it. That's why... that's. That's why I've offered to do it. I've offered to do it because I said, I'm tired of it. I'm going in for kill shots. I don't play around no more. I, know I used to I used to try to bait people into conversations. I just go for the kill shot now. Hebrews with the Hebrew Israelites with the with the uh with all of them. All of them. I don't want to get all into that. But with all of them, I go right for kill shots. I talk about if if you believe in this book, drink poison. If you believe in this book, the devil is God, and here's where he said it. If you believe that Jesus is for the family, here's where he says he's here to separate the family. I don't play with them. I don't play with them. Why? See, you, you, you'll get the, you'll get it like this, and this, this is what I thought debating was. I thought debating was, you know, you start off with your weak points. You start off with your weak points, and then you build up. And then you build up and you build up and then you come with the kill shot. No, fuck that. <laughs> I'm Iron Mike in the ring, baby. I'm trying to knock you out in the first round. I'm coming with kill shots. But, like I said, that should be left out. Create your own umbrella and include everybody. Um, like I said, leave out religion. But could include the brothers that are talking about, I mean... <laughs> you got to be careful who you include. I, I'll say that. But brothers that are doing something for as moving as one and bringing black people together, those are the people that you should include in this umbrella. But have different people and you'll all support each other. If you can get six brothers, and this is to, like I said, this is to all the brothers out there, young, the young people out there. If you can get six people that says, this is what I want to do, and you guys support each other. Say, if you got 100 followers, he has 200 followers, this person got 500 followers. Hey, we're in solidarity. 
So what we're going to do is when you do have time, of course, my followers support me. But, hey, I want you guys to support this brother, too. And the same thing goes to the other person. Hey, support this brother. So now we've created that umbrella. Now we got double, triple the support. That's how it works, family. That's how it works. That's, that's how it works. So I just wanted to say that, make this little video, man, listen, the homework for you guys that are talking solidarity and you understand it and you see it and it's something that you want, your homework is to study the LGBTQ community, okay? Because the community is all the organizations, okay? The community is the people in different organizations. Study it. And like I said, somebody started, man. Somebody started because it has to be solidarity between us. If you, you got a movement and you think you don't need no help, guess what, man? Your movement is going to die. And when you die, your movement dies. You know, you got you got movements that's been here for hundreds of years. And when the, that leader died, the movement kept going. You could talk about the most hateful group on the planet. You could talk about uh christianity you can talk about all these stupid ass movements when those leaders died the movement kept going because it wasn't just about me we had solidarity between everybody don't believe me look at look that up too but like it once again thank you guys for all the positive words thank you guys for your input like i said man solidarity is the key we got to start coming together, family. All right? Okay.